The top 10 luckiest essence openings in Identity 5. Number 10 goes to Skushenka Studio, who has 27 essences for the corner of the Abyss 5 essence. Right here, we can see Eternal Aurora is the S tier skin that we could get from the corner of the Abyss 5 essence. And this happened in season 19. Very, very curious. The unexpected happened, is what they are saying. This is going to be very interesting. We can see getting a few essences, opening them up one by one. If you are just opening, opening free essences. You usually go one by one. I do that too. And I think we are already five essences in, I would say. Just clicking through them, getting the poor trace. Not too lucky yet, but a new emote. I think they, they actually want to get the new emote. Um, here we are going through these essences again so far. Not too bad. We have the golden one after nine pulls. After, okay. How, after nine pulls of essences that you already accumulated from the logic path. That is crazy. Number nine goes to Rice Original, who is opening up the Promised Neverland crossover essences from season 15. Right now, I think we are 11 pulls in. This is going to be the 12th pull. Will we already see, we will already see an 8 tier skin. Okay, an 8 tier skin after 12 pulls. That is extremely good, but let's see if you can actually get the S tier skin as well. I also want to mention that this is not a sorted list, so that means top number one is just as lucky as top number 10 right here, and we are still in the essence opening with Rice Original, opening up essence number 25 and getting Isabella? Are you kidding me? Essence number 12 was Emma, essence number 25 is Isabella, an A and S tier skin in 25 essences. Those were the three essences you get. What? How am I not that lucky? Next up, we have Cherry Wine in spot number eight, and I think they are only opening up essences with the essences they got from the Logic Path and the inspiration they accumulated. Season 21 Essence 2 is the essence where we had Risk Taker for the Doctor, and that essence, I think, was already a lucky one. Right here, we have Roulette for the Nightmare, the eight tier skin. Not too bad. I think those were essences number... 36, I think with the 10 pull, um, Cherry Wine push to Essence 36, so that is an early 8 tier skin already. Alright, so there was another 10 pull where nothing was coming out of it, we are now at Essence 47, 48 I think, 48 is another golden light, it is, no way, how is it the S tier skin, how are people so lucky, we had that with Rice Original who was getting an S tier and an A tier skin before the 60 mark was hit. I think within 25 essences, right? And now, again, before you actually opened up 60 essences, you got an A tier roulette and now an S tier risk taker. Taking 10 screenshots, I would do the same. I would do the same. Continuing this essence opening, I think this is essence 61 going one by one. That's what I would do too if I would only use my inspiration. And there is another one, I think at 62. It is Roulette again, already had that skin before, but again, 62 essences. Usually we're getting one guaranteed at 60, and we already, that was the 61st, actually the 61st essence. Having two A tier and the S tier skins, after opening up 61 essences, that is luck. And this is not over yet, there's more inspiration, opening up more essences, another S tier skin at 73, not an S tier skin, an A tier skin Roulette. For the third time, okay, now I am not sure if this is luck or if that is just being unlucky, getting the same A tier skin three times. Okay, I think J Wine is out of essences, out of inspiration, no inspiration left, no essences left. Just going through the few um, free essences that you can get from the exchange shop. Two more. There are only two more essences left. RIP! That is essence, what, 80? How do you open up 80 essences? and you're getting two S tier skins and three A tier skins. I mean, yes, three times the same A tier skin is quite unlucky, but still, 80 S, what? Is this luck? Spot number seven goes to Magi Identity 5, who's opening up the season 20 essence two after 22 essences right here, is getting the Duchess skin for the Bloody Queen, the A tier skin, absolutely fantastic skin, really, really beautiful, again, 22 essences, that's nothing. To get an A tier skin already immediately jumps out of the essence opening just to tell their friend like, hey, I got something right here. Flexing the skin on them too. That is, that is how we do it. As soon as you get a new good skin, you just show it off. Getting back into the essence opening because there are still 15 
essences left in this opening from the logic path that you can accumulate some free essences i would say and again after 22 essences an a tier skin i would take it i would consider that very very lucky and we are getting into more this is again this is essence 29 the S tier skin after 29 essences. This is just unfair luck. This is not just the S tier skin after 29 essences. No, this is an A tier and an S tier skin with only 29 essences. Next up, we have Lolite Identity 5, who already opened up a total of 40 essences for Season 21 Essence 2 and is getting a golden one right here with a double pull. Actually, three skins right there. Wow, a B, an A, and an S tier. High roller for the novelist, as well as um, Austin 4 by Linus. But most importantly, the risk taker for the doctor with just 40, what is that, 43 essences? And a double pull as well, that is so crazy. Next up, we have Cypher Bay right here, who is opening up the Season 18 Essence 2, which was the Wax Artist Introduction Essence with Fury as S tier skin for the Wax Artist. And we are currently, I think, at 20 Essences. This should be the 20th Essence. I feel like this was a bad idea. Watching these videos is just making me so jealous about the luck. Yes, 20 Essence opened right here. We are jumping into one by one, three essences. You always go one by one and it is golden. The 21st essence. Is that really the S tier skin? I'm telling you right now, this video was a bad idea. I'm feeling so jealous. Prince Ray 8 is going through the season 16 essence one right here, opening up one by one. I think currently this is essence 16 or 17. So very, very early. Oh, it was actually 15. This is 16 right here and you know this was the essence where you could get the toy merchants s tier skin jumping into the next essence right here number 17 you can see how uh prince ray 8 is just clicking on the essences to opening them up look at this oh it's gold cool. just <laughs> shining feather right here i feel like prince ray 8 was not expecting that was just clicking through it was just like oh. wait a moment that is golden what was that 18 essences right oh Come on. This clip is showcasing Everlasting Flowers who has accumulated 53 essences of the season 22 essence one. How do you accumulate 53 essences for free? All right, the first 20 essences right here did not really bring any luck. We got some B tier skins. I do like the B tier skins. Wait, 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 wait. That's the 30th is giving Datura right here. The Tura for the entomologist. Such a beautiful skin. I got her myself. Was very, very happy. That's the only skin I got from this essence. But we already got a golden light after I think 30. And another golden light at 40, which is sweet. Yes. Again, I I feel so jealous about this. Getting an S and an A tier skin before you even opened up. 60 essences to get the guaranteed A tier skin. That is just beyond insane. All right, we are in for a treat. This is actually a little bit of an older essence. Season 10's Essence 3, which was bringing, I think, Lady 13 for the Geisha. A really beautiful skin if you were lucky enough to get it. And we can see Alvin Begino having accumulated a total of 19 essences. And so far we are two essences in nothing too special, three essences in nothing too special. And usually you shouldn't expect something special at three essences. But well, this video is obviously called the luckiest essence openings in Identity 5 with a 10 pull right here. We are seeing the flying guillotine, the A tier skin for Wu Cheng being unlocked, which is absolutely crazy. 13 essences and there are still six more essences uh, remaining that Elvin has so let's see what we can get with these six essences again this this must be no no it can't no if this is the in 19 essences if this is the A tier skin and uh, the S tier skin it's another golden one oh. <laughs> you can hear them in the background just <laughs> clap and being happy about it like how are you not freaking out how how can I get a piece of luck? How can I be this lucky? And the last one goes to Mac Gaming, who's also opening up a little bit of an older essence. Season 11 essence one right here in hopes to get an S tier skin. We are currently at 20 opened essences, going for a temple right here, which makes it 30 opened essences, getting the golden light, getting 
Bone Flute, the A tier skin. Still, after opening just 30 essences, getting an A tier skin is just absolutely fantastic. And we are going for more back to back golden light right here. 40 opened essences, Inferno. Sonata for the violinist, the limited S tier skin. No way. Back to back. Opening up 30, getting an A tier, opening up 40, getting the S tier skin. What? And those were 10 of the luckiest essence openings in Identity 5? How can I get some of that luck? How can I get an S tier skin in what, 20 essences? That's just crazy. Leave your comments in the comment section below about your luck and what you want me to react to next. And of course, if you haven't already, make sure to leave me a fat like. And if you're new, subscribe to The Gaming Grizzly. I hope you all have a fantastic day and I will see you in the next video. Bye bye.